Ladies and gentlemen, I'm Steve Superbisto coming to you with another Wrestle Club exclusive. Here in just a few moments, I will be joined via satellite by the lost soul, Garibay. He will be talking about the Potato Belt Championship coming up this Saturday at 2 p.m. at the Special Olympics Arena in Garden City. Hello, Lost Soul, can you hear me? Loud and clear, Super B. Loud and clear. <sighs> hey, all right. So first, before we get started, I want to know that at the end of this tournament, what does it mean to you to be the Wrestle Club Potato Belt Champion? The Potato Bowl Championship means everything to me, Super B. You see, it means that you represent the state of Idaho, and a man like me has been representing for years. You see, a long time ago, in other locker rooms, they wouldn't call me the lost soul. They wouldn't call me Garibay. They called me Idaho. And for me, that title means everything. Because since day one, I've been representing Idaho from here to there, to there, back on home. And last year, we started this thing known as Wrestle Club. And now Idaho has a place where everybody can wrestle. And you want to talk about the Potato Bowl Championship. If anybody in Idaho knows better, it's the folks that live here, the fans, they know that that means everything. So in the past, you've had lots of chances to win gold. We, everybody knows that you have a long wrestling career. What is different now as opposed to then? You want to know the difference now, Super B? I have no chains around me, and I can be free, be the lost soul that I'm supposed to be. And I don't have to travel from state to state in order to prove a point. I can do it right here in my homeland of Idaho. And I have been gaining experience from years to years since 2010, 13 states under my waistline, but now I am searching for something else, and that is the Potato Bowl Championship around my waist. <sighs> so with potentially the entire roster in this tournament for the Idaho Wrestle Club Potato Belt Championship, is there anybody in particular that you hope to square up with, that you hope the cards fall in your favor that you will stand in the ring with? If I had to choose only one, it would be Frederick from Pride of Olympus because he pushed me to a point where I almost broke. And he, he is the one that I had the most chemistry with. He is the one that almost put me down on my back. He is the one to only hit me with that flat line. And he is the one that I want to face in the finals this Saturday at the Special Olympics. <sighs> now having said that, your new tag team partner, Mr. Hickman, that you have brought over to the Wrestle Club side, who was once a member of Project Mayhem, he is also a part of this tournament. What are you going to do if you two have to square off? You see, Super B, the best thing about a tournament is anything can happen. Your friends become foes, your foes become allies. And Mr. Hickman is no exception. If you're across the ring from me, I'm going to bring 100%. And if I ever get the chance, I'm going to slice that neck and hit him with the flat line. <sighs> Why do you think you will win? Do you have really what it takes to beat everybody in Wrestle Club? Because since day one, I've been getting closer and closer and closer to getting gold around my waist. And this Saturday at the Special Olympics, I'm going to securely attach the Potato Bowl Championship around my waist. And the reason being is because I've been sacrificing, sacrificing my time, sacrificing my body, and sacrificing other things that other people fail to understand. But not for Wrestle Club, 
but for pro wrestling itself. And there ain't no other man that can do the deed than the man that you see. All right, so maybe one last question. Your first round opponent is your ex tag team partner, the instant classic Alaric Knight. Do you have any closing words for Mr. Rick Knight? Alaric Knight, me and you have history, and for the past three years, we've been hitting the road from Washington to Utah, right back home to Idaho. And we traveled the road, the first Idaho tag team known as Lost Colts. But back in May, you threw that all away, didn't you? You spun me around, and you hit me with my flat line. But a man like me, we learn to die, don't we? You see, the snake has been down before, and we learn to sliver right back up. And it's gonna take a lot more to drive me down six feet deep, because I've been there and done that. And this Saturday, I go one-on-one -on -one with my former tag team partner, Alaric Knight. Well, let it be history in the making, and let it be a flat line that you bound to be digging six feet deep, brother, and I'll meet you there, right back down to the snake pit, and may we be lost deeper than we ever been. <sighs> well, there you have it, folks. I want to say thank you to our special guest, the Lost Soul Gear, by joining us via satellite. This Saturday at 2 p.m., we will crown Idaho Wrestle Club's Potato Belt Champion. 2 p.m. at the Special Olympics Arena in Garden City. Be there.